Junior Senior. G'day YouTubers, it's Senior here from Junior Senior Gaming and I'm just coming to you with Farming Simulator 17 information regarding how to set up your Logitech steering wheel properly. Now, I did have a little bit of trouble with this at first. It is uh, sort of like 15, but a little bit different. So, um, let's, let's basically start with the first thing which is the actual software itself so we'll just put that down there there's steam updating so logitech profiler now um you need to install this first if you have got a g27 or a g29 you need to install the software first okay so whatever the logitech profiler is or the other software that comes with it so make sure that's installed now for the G27, because I only have a G27, uh, you need to go to Global Device Settings. Okay. Now, my device settings are like this, but the one thing that you must have for this is you must have Report Combined Pedals must be activated. Okay. So that's very, very important. If you want 900 degree uh, steering, you can change that to 900 degree steering. Uh, if you want to have your uh, center spring uh, up there, up high, that's up to you. But this is how I've got mine set up. But you must have, it's very important, report combined pedals. Very important. Okay. Now, once you've got that activated, you click OK. And then you go out of your actual application. I'm not going to show you how to install that or anything. It's pretty straightforward, so you can do that. Now, off to your actual program here, which is Farming Simulator 17, we go into. We go to Options, and then we head on over to Controls. Now, in this control, under Gamepad here, this is your G27. Anything that's in this list here, remove it. Anything that's in there, remove it. All of that there, all gone. Leave everything else here. So key one, key two, mouse, leave all that alone. Don't touch it. Just under gamepad, remove the gamepad. So under there, remove everything. Now, first thing first, if it's anything like Farming Simulator 15, you had to set up a, a button for it. Okay, so uh, for you had to set up activate. Now, if we have a look for activate, which is up the top, sorry. Uh, activate object okay first just set that to any button it doesn't matter all right so uh, i've gone and set that so uh, we push uh there and that is basically my little uh, that's what, uh, just a button on there it does not matter doesn't matter it's irrelevant but in 15 you had to set that up and i'm pretty sure that 17 is the same as well now first things first let's go down to steering acceleration and blah 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 so down here you can see brake, accelerator, steer, and uh, right steer and left steer. Now this is a little bit tricky, did take me a little bit to figure out. It's reverse, for some stupid reason it's reverse. So if you want to push brake, right, push the accelerator, okay? For the, and I'm, not, I'm serious, this, is, this works, okay? I'm not pulling your chain. Uh, then if you want accelerate, you push the brake, okay? I'm serious. If you want to steer, steer right, okay? Steer left and then steer right. Oh, it didn't work that time. Hang on a second. Let me try that again. So, steer left and then steer right, okay? It will then pick it up. For the left one, you steer right and then steer left and it picks it up then from there you go save it you know drops out does its thing blah 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 okay then we go back and we can go into career now or multiplayer or whatever we want go continue save and it will take us into the game and then from there uh, all the other buttons you can set if you want to go through and set all the other buttons that's fine you can um, you can go in here now we'll just I'll pick something that's not there we go tractor so I push the accelerator and it accelerates I push the brake it stops 
and I push the brake, it reverses. I turn right, it turns right. I turn left, it turns left. See? Simple. Now, one other thing that I would like to cover while we're actually in here is, we'll quit game, uh, dead zones. Uh, now, dead zones is something that's really a pain in this game. It is a pain. If you go over to dead zones here, now, uh, mine keeps resetting. For some reason, uh, it keeps re resetting. So, oh no, there we go. It's saved it now. So that last update fixed it. Sorry, stupid me. I'm going to put that on two. If you try, I think zero. If we try zero, that's too much. But we'll try that for now. Um, axis one. So if we go back to the controls here, you'll see where if we scroll down, uh, steering left and right is axis one. See that? Axis one. So back over here. And axis one, you can change to uh, zero or two, whatever you like, uh, you can change that to. Then you go save. It drops out again. I don't know why it does that. It's a silly game. And then back out of there and then back to Korea. And then we'll continue on with the Korea and start. And away we go. But uh, So now it's... There we go. It's loaded the game. Loaded the save game. We'll just run over to this uh, pickup over here. Jump in the pickup. And there we go. So zero is working actually quite good for me. And there we go, we can drive around. It's more sort of touchy, but if you want that little play in there, you just adjust that to how you like it. So increasing that percentage will give you more of a play in the steering wheel, more like an old school tractor. Or if you're like me and you just can't stand that, then you um, go and um, you just decrease it to zero like I've done and there's no play in there at all. Well, guys, that is pretty much it for this tutorial. I hope it's helped you. Uh, so, you know, for those people with the Logitech G27 users who are having a lot of issue with Farming Simulator 2017, you can now fix that. And um, it's very similar to 15, but this is a more modern update for it. Okay, so there we go, guys. Thank you very much for watching. If this is the first time you've seen Junior Senior Gaming, then make sure you head on over to the Junior Senior Gaming channel and check it out. We have over 1,400 videos for you to view. There's not only Farming Simulator 17, but there is also um, other. There's Farming Simulator 15. There's Euro Truck Simulator 2, American Truck Simulator. There's um, uh, other vehicle simulation games. There's also Mafia 3. Um, GTA, there's heaps and heaps of stuff there guys, heaps of videos for you to watch, so make sure you check it out. But that's it from me, look, keep the shiny side up and the greasy side down, and I'm 1010 on the side, and remember, GAME ON! Thanks for watching YouTubers, if you'd like to see more videos, then click on the links beside. Just over here, it's ETS2, and we're looking at the Volvo FM12. Just down there in Forza Horizon 3, we're doing co-op multiplayer, and what mischief do we get up to? Check it out and see. If you'd like to visit our website, or you'd like to subscribe, then click on the links below. Thanks again for watching, YouTubers, and remember, game on!